he goes up to uh, this guy with the dog. He says, uh, your dog bite? does your dog bite? And he says, no. And he goes to pet him. The dog bites him. He goes, I thought you said that your dog does not bite him. He goes, that's not my dog. <laughs> so Peter, we got some really interesting news and you're going to have to answer for some of this now. Okay, here's, check this out. This it's was, been a hard day. Okay. Do you remember that house that you bought us? Remember that time we were talking about how we all need a place downtown to go after like the party's dying down, the clubs are closed, that we all need a place to go at the end of the night to take the party. Yeah. And then you were nice enough that you bought us that house. Yes, I did. How and much was it? Well, well it was, uh, I think, what you tell me? It was like 2.5 million or something? Uh, yeah, at least two, two, right. three million. You're the, one, you're the one that Oh, paid, you're filming this. You're the one that paid what for is cash. For? Yes. But anyways, Paige is gonna tell you what happened to that house today. What, what happened to the house? So, we had this really great idea for a community mural project. There were signs encour encouraging uh, people to come out and paint. So we did on Monday, and it turned out great. Nobody bothered us. Even police officers talked to us, and everybody loved it. Is this the Rolling Stones logo you've got on the go? No, but it's definitely Stones inspired. Ah, is this going to be based on a Stones song or something? Uh, it could be. I haven't thought of a good lyric for this one yet. That has yet to reveal itself, I guess. Yeah, it kind of all comes out as I go. And so today I invited Sean to come and continue the mural. Now I'm trying to decide where I'm going to start on this wall. There's a couple of things that I want to do. That is to say, I want to work with some of these like spaces in between the other pieces. Because that's just something that I enjoy. The same way that I enjoy when uh, people are singing Beatles songs, right? Some guy will be having a jam with his guitar and he'll be singing Help. I'll come in on the harmonies. That's always my favorite, to come in and kick some ass in the harmonies because it gets everybody hype for the whole thing. And also gives that other person, like, their moment to shine. Because, you know, I don't want to take their moment to shine. I want to, like, facilitate their moment to shine. But that's all neither here nor there. I enjoying the fun and I start turning this, um green gooey planet into a planet by adding blue land on it which is the reverse of what you would think right between the green and blue reversed and then uh, as I'm painting see I was in the middle of doing that white face that I was doing and there's this pink neon pink hair yeah, I was gonna give it sunglasses and blue lips and the whole thing it was gonna be like a like like a like a hip hop or kind of funky dude <laughs> Don't go painting the dog. I know that's why you bought <laughs> Such a clean white canvas. I know. And just one dot? She's asking. I was in the middle of painting his hair when John Q. Law and, uh, and his sidekick there came over and was like, No, no, no. Hey guys. Good, thank you. What's that? Um, apparently this wall uh, belongs to the Comfort uh, Hotel. Uh, that wall is private property belonging to the hotel. I almost called it the hospital. Uh, and that, uh, no, this is not a community mural. And no, we're not entitled to paint this. So you had already been painting it for how many days? One full day before. Right, so one full day, so, so yesterday. Space in, no, Monday. Oh, oh Monday, space okay. space in between, so the stuff was still up, so nobody said, hey, someone painted on our wall and right. got rid of it. So I sent Paige along. She took lemon, she took the paint, and we took everything, came back to the pad where we are now. Yeah. And, and I went in and I spoke to the hotel manager, who was very uh, forceful in bringing home the fact that no, a community mural does not go on that wall, will never go on that wall, it's not allowed. I was just very apologetic and uh, yeah, we uh, would never have done that had we known it was a legitimate mistake and uh, never do anything like that again and we won't touch a wall and uh, the cops sort of collected up everybody's name and address. Um, I, I don't know you so Hi. all I could give him was your first name and uh, she's like the roommate of a friend of my friend kind of thing. Yeah. And uh, then uh, I sort of, you know, gave a very respectful little bow and beat a hasty retreat. <laughs> Which brings us to the present. Nice. What's your next move? Uh, find another wall. Ding! <laughs> Come here, Lemon! So that was a good fright we got. Not really a fright. I kind of knew we were going to be okay and just get out of it easy. We're not like, you know, we're not criminals or nothing. We maybe look like a riffraff, but we're not, we're not dangerous. 
And besides, they've got our address, so they can they know how to get in touch with us if they need us for anything more. Who could ask for anything more? We are looking up the song Who Could Ask For Anything More? Because the line got stuck in my head. Who could ask for anything more? And uh, every time I went to sing it, I'd start singing Gray skies are gonna clear up, put on a happy face. As if who could ask for anything more was the last line of that. And it's clearly not, so I'm finding out what, ah, here we go. That's right. What's it all about, Lemon? Old man trouble, I don't mind him. I don't remember the tune for that part. <laughs> you, old man trouble, I don't mind him. You won't find him round my door. I've got starlight. I've got sweet dreams. She's got her man who could ask for anything more. Ouch. Oh, I'm use this for my cane. Who could ask for anything more? This is called what? Space Gong. Nice. Okay. It's really Ooh. cool, like, eating these sounds. <laughs> <laughs> really depressing, like, but I did the demo for Ruby Dog, and it was all in, like, these kind of key styles. So it sounds, like, really droning. as the, 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 the sketch and turning it into this is like the exciting part of that process for me. Yeah. But I'm so far removed from any of that now that if I was gonna get into it, I'd be getting into it like making a movie about the guy who was the best at it. Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that was a beautiful ending to that song.